It is time for the Slocum Dixon Medical Moments with Slocum Dixon Medical Group. Located on Burstone Road in New Hartford, 798-1500 and SDMG.com. Slocum Dixon Medical Group, SDMG.com. And, of course, you can like the Facebook page as well. Adrian in studio as always. Adrian, good morning. Good morning. Um, uh, we talked about a little earlier. How is the how is the Boilermaker for you? Because I, I haven't seen you since the, boiler, since the prep of Boilermaker. Yeah, it was great. I think it's a great event for everyone. You know, the weather was good. It wasn't too hot. And, you know, it's just tons of fun. And... As far as uh, as far as being a runner goes, uh, you know, a little bit of mist, a little bit of rain here and there, not too hot, not too cold, like like Goldilocks and Three Bears. It was like it's just right. Right. Yeah, I know because the, the worst thing is like you know to get a really hot day. I was like dreading that, but it was perfect. So. Absolutely. So who did you bring you uh, with you this? Week? So we've been really fortunate to have a lot of new doctors join our group. Um, you know, over the summer and going into the fall, and so one of our new podiatrists, Dr. Christopher Powers, who is a local guy, has come back and. Um, joined our group and so we're really happy to have him and he's here today with us wonderful dr powers good morning how are you good morning morning uh welcome welcome home you're you're a local guy right yeah i grew up in herkimer new york uh for my entire life high school and then as soon as high school happened i moved down to the city and i was there for 13 years very wow. cool and now and now back and now back home there's something about central new york and uh, as far as like going away and doing the the college thing and you know going through your get, getting all the degrees and all the training and all that stuff and being able to come back and do it in you know your home area it's got to be super special no it's great it's, it's absolutely great it's so much support people family, friends, everybody reaches out to you. They're so excited for you to come back. It's, it's a really nice feeling to have that. All right, so uh, podiatry, we're talking like feet, ankles, that kind of stuff. Yep. Okay, can I just tell you, I have the worst ankles ever. Um, and, and no, seriously. And, 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 I'm so, I'm, I, and you probably get this all the time. You'd be like, oh, you're all a podiatrist. Time. Anywhere, any place, you can as take as, off their shoes. As soon as, as, soon as, as, soon as they see me, they take off. Oh. At the bar, at the grocery store, today. <laughs> Yes, I would like a fishbowl and a way. Oh, but you're a podiatrist? Hold on. Let me take no, but, but seriously, like, um, ever since I was a kid, I always had, like, this tendency to roll my ankle and, and whatnot. I've never, like, fractured or anything. Is there something that people can do to kind of just strengthen ankles and whatnot or help prevent that? Because, honestly, I'm tired of falling in public. And if I can avoid that. And it always happens. Like, it happened before the bridal show at the Radisson last year. I'll I'm in a this. tuxedo. Mm -hmm. I'm helping people. And all of a sudden, I go down like a sack of crap. So, if no, there's, really so, funny, so though, yeah, so. yeah, yeah. Thanks, Liz. You're uh, so, if there's something that, like, things that I could do to kind of help myself not look like an ass in public, that would be fantastic. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if I'm that a miracle worker, but. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but honestly, there's like there's multiple etiologies for like um, the ankle instability. You, if you sprain your ankle once, you are prone to sprain them multiple times the rest of your life because you just uh, kind of like a concussion. Once you get your first one, the, yeah. the other ones are so much easier. Yeah, um, you can do like proprioceptive training with physical therapy to help strengthen up the muscles around the ankle. Um, of course, there's always surgery. Uh, it helps yeah, train up the ligaments, but we can skip that one. one. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that was a little invasive. Uh, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> Uh, ankle braces, you know, elastic ankle braces, something so simple as that can just give you enough stability to in reassurance so you um, don't roll as much. As far as, uh, and again, it's a Slocum Dixon medical moment, uh, courtesy of Slocum Dixon Medical Group. Make sure you like them on Facebook. Just type in Slocum Dixon and uh, press like. And, of course, they're located on Burstone Road. Uh, being a podiatrist, what is one thing that uh, y you may see on a regular basis or something that most people think is nothing but you, they should definitely get checked out as far as their feet go? Uh, for diabetics, it's a lot, a very common thing. Um, okay. They should definitely be checked out regularly just because all a lot of the manifestations of diabetes present in the feet and ankle first because it's the farthest thing from your heart usually. Um, that's one huge category. Another very common thing is like plantar fasciitis and heel pain. I get that from all across the board. It doesn't matter what kind of problems you have. And people think it's always oh, it just you know from being on my feet all day, but actually it has a a definitive cause and, and it's easy to treat. Is it is it uh, is it more in ladies because of the heels or is it uh, is it across the board? Uh, I mean, it's across the board, yes, but technically, it's usually in, in females, especially after birthing age, because all those hormones used to reduce uh, relax the ligaments also relaxes the ligaments in your feet. Okay, and so they have a chance a uh, tendency to get more. 
Planet Fat Sherry. I think it's funny. He, he started talking about pregnancy and hormones, and my mind went somewhere else. And he's like, yeah, it affects the feet, too. I'm like, yeah, no kidding. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> of course, of course it does. So, um, Adrian, uh, before we wrap things up, we were talking about uh, the fact that uh, so many, just like Dr. Powers, uh, so many doctors are coming into Slocum Dixon because, obviously, you know, people know Slocum Dixon is the place to go and the place to be. Uh, talk about the, the influx of what you got coming in. Yeah, so we um, last month we had Dr. Vasali, who was also a local, um, a local person who, from Notre Dame who came back, and he's a hospitalist here, so he's with our group. Um, and then Dr. Powers came, and then we have Dr. Bison, who's a cardiologist, joining us in September, um, as well as Dr. Dean, who is a new um, an oncologist, hematologist, that's going to also be joining our group. And then later on down the road, we have a family practice physician, Dr. Odua, who is coming as well. So got a, a big group of people coming in, and we're we're always super excited for that. And if you're looking for a uh, a new family practice or uh, it, it, seriously, I'm a huge Slocum guy. I always have been. And uh, to be able to go see your normal doctor and be able to just walk down the hall and get the test done rather than have to make an appointment, come back in three weeks and take extra time off and just have everything all under one roof and everyone knows what they're talking about. Uh, it's fantastic. Slocum Dixon Medical Moments, Slocum Dixon Medical Group, Burstone Road, New Hartford, 798-1500, sdmg.com. Guys, thank you so much for coming. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you very much.